Hey guys, Pavel Barber here, and I've got some huge news. I'm gonna be trying out for a professional three-on-three -three hockey team in this new up-and-coming league called Three Ice. I wanna give a big thank you to Bit Casino for betting on me. It's something I think I can do, but I'm way behind in my training. I've just been instructing for the past 10 years or so, so I got a lot of work ahead of me, but I hope you guys join me along for the journey. It's a big opportunity for me and I really want to thank you guys who have been following my social media and my YouTube channel because you guys know where I came from. Just making fun videos, showing off my skill, trying to do the instructor thing and then an opportunity like this comes about and I'm ready for it. I got a lot of work ahead of me but it's just amazing what happens from just putting yourself out there, making a YouTube channel to getting a professional tryout on a three on three team in this new league which is kind of catered towards my skill set, but I'm 32 years old, my speed's not where it was, my skills aren't where they were when I was playing, so tons of work ahead of me, uh, but I'm really ready for the opportunity. So for those of you who don't know my story, I actually represented Team Canada playing indoor hockey and then moved out to Vancouver to play field hockey for Team Canada, and I committed my whole life and my training to that from 18 years old all the way up to when I was 25 where I quit the sport. Uh, so that's what got me all the way out to Vancouver and then I joined the Canadian floorball team. So I've really been bouncing around from sport to sport, training, uh, you know, in a professional setting but away from hockey a little bit. On the side, I got a job at the University of British Columbia teaching hockey skills. That's where I started my YouTube channel. I never wanted to be off the ice, always wanted to be involved in the game but there's been so much time away from ice hockey in terms of actually training myself. I've been committing my whole life to training and making other people better, but now it's time to make myself better. The three on three league's waiting. Uh, it's an opportunity of a lifetime and uh, I'm gonna commit everything to it. Pavel, I think with your skills, your speed, your vision, I think you could absolutely crush it in three ice. Really, eh? Absolutely. Uh, the three on three format, the breakaway hair on fire, tactical passing, fun one. This is your game, and we'd love to have a player like you in our game. Man, that sounds awesome. All right, guys, we're headed to a three-on-three -three skate at Etobicoke Canlan with the guys at speed. They've set up a little bit of a practice, and then we got a three-on-three -three skate to finish it off. First time skating in a while. Definitely the first time playing three-on-three -three in a while, so we'll see how we do, uh, but let's head on the road.
Ah! I just love this sport so much. Ever since I was five years old, I was obsessed with hockey. Loved skating on the outdoor rinks. Uh, we didn't have a lot of money growing up, so no private lessons or anything like that, but I really love breaking down plays myself. Love watching my favorite players, reenacting their skill, and, and just watching replay after replay in hopes to understand how these pro players did these moves. This thing all started by watching Pavel Datsuk. I would watch every single shift he had and marked at what part of the period he had a skill that separated him from the rest and compiled highlights from that. Eventually made my own YouTube channel to put out my own stuff based on my understanding of what separated uh, good players from great players at the pro level. Uh, with that said, I know exactly what I need to do to prepare. I'm well behind uh, training wise compared to all these other guys for sure. Just because you have stick handling doesn't mean you can compete at this level and no one is more aware of that than I am. I'm just a guy who loves hockey, I love teaching it and I love being on the outdoor rinks and getting better myself. There's nothing more therapeutic to me than being on the outdoor rink, the crisp outdoor, just shooting a puck around, learning a new skill, getting better. Nothing beats that for me, but it's time to get serious. It's time to put this into practice and find a way to compete in this three-on-three -three league. So tryouts are in April in Las Vegas, so only a few months away. I got the World Floorball Championships in Finland uh, next month. And then we got COVID protocol here in Ontario. All the rinks are shut down. Finding competition to play against is not easy, but I'm lucky to be able to use outdoor rinks like this. Tons of outdoor rinks in Toronto. But the main thing I gotta do is make sure all my individual skills are gonna be able to be used against players. You know, making my reads, being able to make the right move at the right time in game you know nothing really compares to being under pressure so i gotta get a lot of games in so i set some three on three skates up with some guys from ryerson uh we've got some other three on three skates i'm lucky to know some guys who run uh skates with some high level players off and on here so we're gonna be hitting those up as much as we can we're gonna be on the outdoor rinks as much as we can uh just trying to simulate being under pressure using moves tactically and just being aware of our surroundings so how three ice operates they're gonna be making a bunch of tour stops in a, a few different cities and they're gonna be running it kind of tournament style so they're gonna have a round robin and then the top teams are gonna end up playing each other the top four there uh, until we have a champion crowned uh, short games so they're two eight minute periods so 16 minute long games there and then we're gonna we're gonna find out who wins that same day and as mentioned earlier, this is a very professional league. So with three ice, there's a total of $2 million USD to be won, $1 million to the team that wins the regular season, and then another $1 million to the team that wins the playoff championship round. 
And once again, huge shout out to Bit Casino for betting on me. None of this would be possible without you, but it's time to get to work. Let's go.